Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Breakfast Television. Going to nine degrees today, a great, great day. And we've invited Mike from Mike's Bloggity Blog in here to help us get into the Christmas season. How are you, Mike? Good, how are you? Good, and uh, I know you weren't watching the game yesterday because you had to watch, what did you watch again? <laughs> what was this? What? Uh, there was a Survivor Marathon on. <laughs> <laughs> and I really like Survivor well, a lot. Fair enough. It was fans versus favorites. <laughs> and you knew, so, yeah. you knew the stamps were going to win. I knew. So. I TiVoed the stamps. I'll watch it tomorrow. Oh, good, good. Don't ruin it for me. No, I don't want to. I won't tell you what happened. Okay. Uh, don't look at any papers, by the way. Okay. <laughs> All right. So you went and found a whole bunch of different blogs and yes. different sites for people who want to get into the Christmas spirit. First one being at the uh, do-it-yourself Christmas. What's yeah, this about? do it yourself. I mean, obviously the economy is not doing too well right now, so people are going to want to start saving money. Sure. Uh, so do it yourself Christmas. It's this really great website. Yeah. Uh, it's on Get Rich Slowly, uh, and basically it has 34 ways that you can. Uh, do cheap Christmas gifts, uh, whether uh, it talks about like memory drawings, so yeah. like maybe you and I had a fun time out one night, we, I do your drawing, put it in a frame, there you go, Merry Christmas. Right. Or there's also um, a photo bo a book, that you, a hollow book. Yeah, it shows you how to hollow, I, I clicked on that one, I don't know, Mike, if you can find it there, click on the hollow book, but it's so cool. Now here it is, it shows you how to make your own hollow book. Yeah, 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 so say you have an extra copy of Twilight lying around. Sure. You just glue all the pages together, and then you cut out the pages in the middle, and you put a whole bunch of stuff in there. So Keep it's, scrolling it, way down, Mike, it's got a load there, it is. Yeah. Well. It gives you the whole, there's about eight pictures in a row, it shows you all the ways you can make your own hollow book. Yeah, it's really, really, it's, it's easy, and I mean, I think at this point, with the economy, we're going to have to start doing stuff like this. We can't buy everyone a Nintendo we can, Wii. We can. As much as we want to, we can. All right, let's go to uh, best Christmas gift suggestions. Yes. So many people, especially as we kind of get closer and closer, are like, I need a suggestion, I need some help, because maybe they can't come up with the idea on their own. So this Rodney's Gift Galleries yeah. has every kind of gift suggestion you could ever like imagine so whether it's for kids or tweens or teens or the guy or the girl or the husband wife anything like yeah. it's all there it's all these really really cool lists so it's even newborn baby lists so Seriously? It's, yeah and there's pictures and there's it takes you the links where you can um and you know what's funny is mike didn't get that one loaded up in the computer and he's in a frenzy over there <laughs> trying to get it going but that's okay mike let's go to the next one because i think it's about time we showed people how to make their own snowflake yes how about this that? Yeah. Is the funnest, is funnest, most fun website. Yeah. <laughs> most fun most website, grooviest ever. Grooviest website. Yeah. That you can kind of, uh, you go to it and it's this, it's this, it's this interactive site and it folds up all the paper for you, and then you. Uh, then you kind of cut all the snowflakes out, all the pieces of paper, yeah. and then you uh, click preview and it unfolds the snowflake. For you. Here it goes. I swear so, it's coming up any second now. You're, as you talk and talk, thinking, what did like we do this. that we did? There we go. <laughs> yes. So make your own snowflake. You click on there and this little piece of paper comes up and you fold it like that. It does it all for you. There you go. Maybe you're not allowed being around scissors. See. So. There you go. Just cut a lot of it up. <laughs> you just destroyed the. <laughs> my, wow. my what are you doing? <laughs> this that's is gonna be the best snowflake ever. Okay, now let's so see now what that looks preview. like. Yeah. Yes. Well, see, see? that's not all that's bad. Not bad. It works. Out. Wow. Yeah, and then you good. can cut more. You can start over again. You will spend hours and hours and hours on this. It's but so what fun. if you want to make a gingerbread man? There's also a make your own gingerbread man website. Is it really? Yeah, it's really cool. You can put sprinkles and eyes and. Uh, frosting all around it and everything like that. <laughs> it's the funnest time a person I can ever imagine. You, it's fun. Yeah. Yes, and there's also a make your own snowman. All right, Mike, see? we'll take either one of those, Mike. A snowman. Oh, there's a snowman there we go. one. There you snowman. go. So on the left there, see that there are all the different types of. Um, drag them over. Drag those over in the sky, I guess. <laughs> uh, <laughs> there we go. That's apparently a floating snowman we're making. <laughs> I mean, a bottom heavy snow. Yeah, that's a yeah. Okay, so, now. <laughs> Mike apparently has never been snow. What are you, Mike? This is great for if you're teaching someone how to make a snowman, I guess. Uh, so then, and there's all the twigs on the side, on the side there Grab for arms. Yeah, that's a, that's quite a snowman you got going on there, buddy. So this is Mike McHugh and part of our crack research department here. <laughs> you can't even see that. That is the most pathetic snowman I've ever seen. <laughs> yes, it has a couple noses. Yeah. And you can just put all... Anyway, so you can there's just do whatever Mike. you want. There's Mike working hard. Look at him. 
He's, um, he's going to start drooling out of one side of his mouth there on that computer. <laughs> All right, so that's... There we go. Look, look, it looks like a snowman now. And if anybody wants these Somewhere. links, we're going to tell you how you can get to them at the end. Yes, okay. yes. Uh, mean gadget gifts for yes. people you hate. So maybe you have extra money lying around. Maybe you would prefer to get gifts for people you hate more than people you love. Sure. The, uh, Wired, magazine, a technology magazine, has a great... Uh, website up right now on their on their website I guess uh, yeah. 10 mean gadgets uh, for people that you dislike <laughs> and that I don't know if anyone knows the Microsoft Zune it is not a good gift to give someone especially the first version it is not good at all uh, if you scroll down there they have the poly station 3 there's the poly station 3 there for you <laughs> what is that <laughs> these are things that didn't work no these are gifts that are actually up there that you can buy people that are useless and would <laughs> anger them if you got them. <laughs> yes. Brutal. There's also a V that you can buy. That's a turkey thermometer. Like why do you ever need a turkey <laughs> thermometer? Uh, that right there is a is a battery charger for your phone. Um, and it weighs more and it's bigger than actually if you just brought your cell phone charger with you. <laughs> <laughs> so like why do you so why? Like what do you want that? Further down there's something called toilet tunes. Uh, you don't want to press play on that. Do not press play on that. Uh, <laughs> so there, that's toilet tunes there. And so as soon as the toilet seat goes up, it starts playing really annoying music. So people don't hang out in your bathroom. And then they, yeah, you always remember to put the toilet always seat down. Always put the toilet seat down, yes. Oh, see Which how I, important. Oh, that's a fake sunroof. <laughs> oh, yeah. I've heard of those. It's like a piece of shiny bit yeah. you stick to your car. Yes. And it looks like you have a sunroof. Yes, I have one on my eye on. <laughs> It's like a Mercedes now. Oh, way No one can tell the difference. No, I bet so. you as soon as you stuck that on there, you were sad. It's like the same. Okay. Uh, next one, Philly Burbs, the do's and don'ts of outdoor holiday decorating. Uh, as we've all seen, there are some pretty horrendous decorations out there for the holidays. There we go, famous Chevy Chase uh, film right there. Yeah. But scrolling down, it's really good. It has the do's and don'ts. So the first one is, it, it's a do. It, so it says, d put lots, but not, don't put too many. Like, make sure. it classy. Um, the one below it is don't cover every piece of lawn <laughs> on your... Yeah. Uh, it's just people go insane. The next one, you know, it's really good. It's use fresh stuff if you have it. So fresh wreaths and things like that. It's really good. I think people... That's also maybe a good Christmas gift, like a pre-Christmas gift. So if you have a friend that is a bad decorator, just be like, look at this link I found. And I won't charge <laughs> you. Merry Christmas. That applies to you directly. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. And then our final one, I believe, funniest Christmas site. Yes, it's, <laughs> it's is it Christmas dot com. Uh, it's it's that easy. Is it Christmas? No, it's not Christmas dot com. It's not Christmas. Please, it's not. Stop just, asking. We got months to go. Yeah. So when your kids are like, Mom, Dad, is it Christmas? Be like, Go to the website. No, it's not. Leave me alone. And that's all that site is. There's nothing else on it. It's just no. Just that's leave me funny. Alone. So Christmas Day though, I guess it's gonna be like. I, I wonder what it, wonder what'll happen now. I want to see on Christmas Day yeah. what happens. Maybe I'll have Mike Snowman up there. <laughs> Mike's so, severely so. wounded snowman. <laughs> oh, that's yes, excellent. Yes, and so all these links are up on my blog right now. Mike's, Mike's bloggityblog.com. Easy enough to find. Mike's yeah. bloggityblog.com is where you can find all of the links to all of those websites. There it is right there on the screen. Yes. And Mike, always good of you to come Thank by. Thank you. Wow, was, always a good time. I always feel like I'm, in t I'm ready for Christmas now, but I know yeah. it's not Christmas. Still. No. no. <laughs> It's not. <laughs> not yet. Andrew check Allen. Tomorrow. You check tomorrow. See if it is. <laughs> Andrew Allen's going there. There's our other Mike doing all the work. Thanks, Mike. Yeah, really great job. Andrew Allen, the Living Room Sessions is the CD. He's going to be playing a little from it right after this.